everybody! Welcome back yes. to Let's Play Oblivion! This is your host, Fico Dreamer. And this guy has some really weird fucking hair. But whatever. Some people are like that. We are going to go and turn in this quest that we just completed. So much clutter. All right, where is my vampire boss? There he is. Hey, hey, hey! So, you infiltrated the Imperial prison, eliminated Vale and Dreth, and killed not one guard. Most excellent. Hmm. In addition to your standard reward, I present to you this bonus. Behold. The Scales of Pitiless Justice. While carried, the scales will magically enhance your strength, intelligence, and agility, but diminish your personality. A powerful tool indeed. Huh. Okay, I gotta look at this. One second. Where is it? I don't see it. Ah, here it is. The Scales of Pitiless Justice. They won't let me actually look at it. it sells for 100 gold, but it doesn't tell me how much it lowers my personality. Okay, here we go. Intelligence. Increased agility, increased speed, increased personality is down to 48. Um, how much is my personality normally? I'm just gonna drop that 50. So it only lowers my personality by two. I'm actually oh, strength, agility, intelligence plus two, per personality minus two. That's actually not too bad. So I can deal with that. Wait, I want a new contract. Brother. If I may have a word? Of course. What is it? So is it true about your latest contract? The girl's nanny was actually a fighter's guild bodyguard? Oh, we've already heard that. Word certainly gets around fast. That's okay, that's strange. I want to do this. Just go... Meow, boing. Oh, I'm so good. Moving on. You are truly an asset to this sanctuary. Oh, I look, I can pick up this too. Work out that well. Ah, well. I'd love to Wee, I'm just gonna set that over here. They look so much better right there. I would. I really wish I could pick up items though and actually rotate them, but it, it won't let me do that. So it sucks. All right, talk to me, buddy. I have a special contract that needs fulfillment. In truth. I don't wish to offer it to any other family member. I've come to rely on your abilities. Oh, cool. Well, what is the contract then? We're usually called upon to take a life, but not this time. This contract requires us to stage the assassination of a marked man. Are you ready? Stage? Huh, yes, I'm ready. Please do tell me about this contract. I'm very interested. You must go to the city of Coral and break into the house of Francois Mottieri. Inside, you will find Mottieri waiting for you. Do not kill him. You see, Francois Mottieri is a marked man. He owes a considerable sum to the wrong kind of people, so they have sent an enforcer to kill him. Here. You will use this specially poisoned knife to stage Mottieri's death in the enforcer's presence. Mottieri himself will provide more details. This is an unusual contract. Mottieri had to make a special arrangement with us before it was approved. I trust in your professionalism. Huh. Uh, can you tell me about this poison knife? How is it not going to kill him? The blade has been coated with a rare poison called Langerwine. One drop in a normal human bloodstream will mimic the effects of death immediately. I have provided you with a vial of antidote, 
which will be used to revive Francois Mottieri after you successfully stage his death. You should also know that there's only enough Langer wine on the blade for this one contract. After Mottieri is sliced, the knife will be useless. Huh. Very interesting. I'll... Tell me about the special arrangement he had to make. The Dark Brotherhood is not in the business of staging deaths, no matter how much gold is offered. Sithis demands blood, and blood must be paid. In order to accept the contract, we demanded a life. Motiere offered his mother, and we accepted. Lucien has already taken care of that uh, detail. Oh my god! This guy had them kill his mother just so he could live? That is awful! Well, uh, if I had a choice in the matter, I would kill him personally. You too. But I don't have a choice. I have to listen to the Dark Brotherhood. Oh my god, who would... <sighs> what kind of monster sacrifices his own mother to save his own goddamn tail? Just, just ridiculous. Purely ridiculous. I would kill this motherfucker if I had a choice, but I don't. I don't have a choice. And I just realized... I need to level up. Hmm. What's this? Oh, this must be the other entrance. Okay. Oh, let's see, how much time do I got? I got a couple minutes. Uh, we need to rest... Oh, yeah. Somewhere. Why do you bother me? Go away. Hmm. Where can we rest, though? We need an inn. That's what we need. La 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 la. La 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 la. Or I could just go back to my house. Stand clear. But that's all way in another fucking state. Wait, where's this contract? Corel. Hmm. Alright, let's stop by the waterfront, get a good night's sleep in my personal guild headquarters, then we will go and carry out this contract. How does that sound, everybody? That sounds like a great idea, Sarah. The fuck? Whoa! What's going on here? Um... Glitch? Yeah, that's a... That's a definite glitch. I can't... I can't even get out of here. What's going on? Uh... Yeah, that's definitely a glitch. Let's try reloading that. Huh, okay. Apparently I've fallen through the stairs. Whatever. Weird. Weird. Weird, weird people. Alright, uh... I can't remember where the... The guild is. It's over here. I remember. I'm just... Not totally in it. Whew. Okay. Let's go get a good night's sleep. Oh, wait. I was already in here. You. Ah, uh, nah. Let's just sleep here. Ah, oh, get a good, good night's sleep all the way to 6 a.m. in the morning. Yay! Let's raise my strength, agility, and personality. Why am I raising those three? Because those are the ones where I get plus three, plus three, plus two. Be a better reason. It's a better reason to level those. Look at this. Agility is 90 now. Ah, uh, damn, I didn't increase my intelligence any. I need to increase my endurance. But strength is good. Strength is very good. And I hit exit and I froze. Greetings to you. Greetings to you. Do I have anything that I need to, you know, stuff away? Yeah, let's stuff that away. Uh, cure poison, cure healing. A cure healing. Potion of healing. Uh, let's put that in there, and this in there. And 
And I think... Oh wait, I want to put that other thing in there. Where was it? This book. The Lusty Argonian Maid. I would like to put that there. And I can't remove this. Ah, da 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 da. I need to love them with that. The antidote. God, I got so many keys. Here it is. Summon Daedroth. I want to use this when I get the chance. Actually, I can use it right now. Let's get out of here first. As soon as I remember where the door is. Alright, here we go. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Holy crap! That is awesome. Hi, buddy. You remind me of Renekton from League of Legends. <laughs> it's Renekton when he's naked. Oh, shit. Oh, he follows me. That's even cooler. Dude, I want you as a pet. Aww. Now, why can't I have a creature like that as a pet? That would be so fucking epic. Ugh. If anybody knows anything about getting him as a pet... Uh... Oh, that's right. These guards got killed. Nobody came and removed their bodies? Okay. Come here, guard. Who stole your pants? Oh my god! A pervert's been by here. They stole his pants. Nobody else is missing their pants. Huh. Okay. Somebody stole this guy's pants. You have my ear, citizen. Yeah, and you're just gonna stand there and look at this? Somebody stole this man's pants and possibly ass raped his corpse. Okay, whatever. When we return, everybody, we will go ahead with the next quest. Till then.